Hey, it's being released, it's being released, it's being released! What's up everybody, Salam alaikum. How's everybody doing? I hope everybody's having a great day. Jumma Mubarak to everybody. Today is June 23rd, 2017. SubhanAllah. This, my friends, is the last vlog of Ramadan 2017. I'm so sad and subhanAllah like it, the time just flew by so quickly so quickly just the other day we said oh Ramadan just came now it's gone subhanAllah I hope we all took advantage of it like we should have may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala accept all of our good deeds all of our salat all of our siyam all of our dua inshallah ameen today is super exciting guys because it's being released my music video my cover of adele's hello so let's go ahead and see it right quick do command r to refresh and boom there you are so go ahead and check it out go ahead and click the link in the corner and uh today i have uh, not much planned i do plan on getting a haircut so that's in the works that's going to be happening after Jama. actually. I'm going to be going to Fort Worth to be with my brother for the day. And I'll see you guys later. Alrighty, guys. So I got myself ready to go. I'm about to leave to Fort Worth. But I just want to tell you guys that this song is so important to me because the song is about mending one's relationship with Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. And that's something that we should all be trying to achieve at least during Ramadan and even outside of Ramadan. So that's kind of like the message that I'm trying to push with the song, that we should be making amends and that we should be going back to Allah, inshallah ta'ala. So it's 12.40 and I gotta get over to Fort Worth. So let's go. Alrighty guys, so we're coming up onto the Masjid. Alrighty guys, so we finished up Jama'ah, it was a Actually, that's a unique khutbah that I've attended. You've you know, never had that before? Where the khatib raises money during the khutbah? No. It's always awkward because you're always like, I want to say yes, I want to raise my hand, but am I allowed to speak? Mm -hmm. You can because you're talking yes. to the khatib directly. Oh my God. This is something people don't know in Jum'ah. It's not a one-way lecture. If there is something that you don't agree with or you're confused about, you can talk to the sheikh directly. I, if you don't agree with it, I don't know about disagreeing. Well, I mean, yeah, man, I mean, don't no, don't I, argue with that. the sheikh. I've actually seen that before. That was kind of that was awkward. Don't but, argue with the sheikh. Or but, somebody actually said something to the sheikh because, or the the, the khatib. I, I, it was actually or, yeah. a sheikh, somebody who has a degree in like, Sharia. Said, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> somebody, okay, if you're qualified, of course, but. It is also noted during the time of Umar عنه, that when he was giving the khutbah, a woman corrected him while he was uh, speaking. And so you are allowed to speak to the khatib, but under certain circumstances. So yeah, you are allowed to talk during the khutbah to the khatib only. Not amongst yourselves, you're not supposed to be on your phone because when you're in the khutbah, you are in the state of salah. So you're supposed to act like you are in salah. Quiet, l attentive, listening. Don't fidget with your ring, your jewelry, your watches. Or a spinner. Or a spinner. You're supposed to be listening attentively. So that's the takeaway. We obviously are not gonna have lunch right now. It's the last Friday of Ramadan, subhanAllah. Well, that, I like the way he said that. Imam right? Jahid. So Imam Jahid is an old family friend, known him for so many years. I love the guy. Uh, he has been in the DFW area, specifically in the Fort Worth area, for almost 30 years. Or 30 40. Plus, 30 plus. 40 now? I, I don't... I, I'm a long time. He yeah. is a jewel. Um, I would call him the godfather the godfather of the shayukh in DFW, yes, mashallah. So so definitely it's always good to see him it was always good always to see him. always good. excuse the french he doesn't bs anything he gives it straight as is which is amazing right no no wishy-washy there's no so many stories that he'll tell you where that goes into play subhanallah i don't know what we're doing now i we i just realized i was going the wrong way we're going to see darno well going yeah to, we got to get a haircut that's why It's been how long? It's been a long Two months. Day. Today's the 23rd, okay. You, Two months and a day since I've been here. And look how much my hairs have grown. 
I've come a long oh, way. Why do you have to ruin things when you open your mouth? Without you, my friend. No, no, see, that's why you should not. Say. And you're so ugly, and I know it when I see you again. When I see you again. Allah <laughs> Hadi. You know what that means in Arabic? <laughs> Arabic. Arabic language it means may God, Allah Subhanahu Wa Taala, guide you. Who's Subhanahu Wa Taala? Yeah. Alrighty, guys. So a lot of time has passed. Actually, it is eesh, twenty past eight o'clock, eight twenty right now, and um, we, me and my brother, are going to the masjid. Where are we? Which car? Your car. Oh yeah, my car. And uh, we're going to the masjid to have iftar there, because it's the last iftar that they are serving at the masjid. I have no idea what they're serving, but I was told either Arabi food or Desi food. It's always gonna be one of the two. Do you know what I'm saying? Okay, so we will see you guys there. Peace. Hey guys, so we are here at Masjid Ibrahim again, and you can already smell the tandoori chicken in the air. It's wonderful. You can smell Maghrib actually. Yeah, I'm not gonna <laughs> right now. Indian. Wait, my phone's in the car. On chairs, by the way. <laughs> this is the first. It's the first. I've never had to sit like like this before. Mmm, mashallah. Food is very good. Tasty. Alrighty, guys. So, alhamdulillah, we finished the thought. It was pretty great. Um, what we have next is the last tarawih. This is it. The last tarawih of Ramadan 2017. I hope we all did our best this Ramadan. And I hope we've all been saying the dua in the last 10 nights. Allahumma inaka afuun tuhub al afwa faafu anna or faafu anni if you want to be specific to yourself. Um, so, yeah, it's been a great Ramadan so far. I'm about to go drop off my brother at his place and then we're gonna, what's the word? Ah, rendezvous. We're gonna rendezvous later in the night. And, Insha'Allah, we'll see you guys. Peace. Alrighty, guys. So, alhamdulillah, we just finished Tarawiyah. It's the last Tarawiyah of 2017. I hope Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala accepts from all of us. He accepts our Qiyam, our Siyam, our Salah, our Dua. Ameen, Ya Rabbil Alameen. It is right now 11.10. And uh, Insha'Allah, around 2 a.m., uh, my brother, myself, and a lot of Shabab are gonna get together for last suhoor, inshallah. I'll see you guys then. Peace. Hey guys, how's it going? So, I want to show you guys this real quick. That you can see that it's a pretty clear sky, except there is lightning going everywhere. SubhanAllah, it's ridiculous. It's like this big cloud right there. Oh my god. <laughs> Allah, oh my god. Okay, okay, I'm going back inside. <laughs> Alright guys, as I'm waiting for my brother to come, it's almost 2 a.m. Um, unfortunately, they did have a flat tire, but alhamdulillah, he's taking care of that. Um, and it did start to rain, and it's still lightning and flashing. SubhanAllah, but they're doing okay. Um, while I was waiting, I took it upon myself to actually finish the, or at least try to finish uh, the whole Qur'an, the Khutam and the Qur'an. So with that, I'm going to be reciting the last three suwar, insha'Allah, for you guys. <clears throat> Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Qul huwa Allahu ahad, Allahu samad. لم يلد ولم يولد ولم يقل له كفوا أحد بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم 
قل أعوذ برب الفلق من شر ما خلق ومن شر غاسق إذا وقب ومن شر النفاثات في العقد ومن شر حاسد إذا حسد بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم قل أعوذ برب الناس ملك الناس إله الناس من شر الوسواس الخناس الذي يوسوس في صدور الناس من الجنة والناس May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala accept our siyam, our qiyam, and all of our dua, Ya Rabbil Alameen. I hope everybody's enjoyed this Ramadan. It's just 2 o'clock right now. Uh, SubhanAllah, this Ramadan has been uh, an interesting experience, alhamdulillah. Like I've mentioned before in the vlog, last Ramadan I was not as productive. This Ramadan, alhamdulillah, I've stepped up my game, I've hit my goals, and alhamdulillah, uh, I feel very, very happy and blessed that I got to experience this Ramadan. And right now, I feel super grateful and thankful to Allah Subhanahu Wa Taala that He allowed me to have this Ramadan, to have this opportunity. And I just feel so humbled that I had that. So with that, uh, I'm gonna call up my brother soon and check up on him and see where he's at, so that we can have our last suhoor together, inshallah, bi idnillah. Um, there is something else that's happening later as you're watching this that that morning this morning uh, a surprise is gonna happen and you're gonna be a witness to that inshallah so I'm super excited and we didn't find out until this afternoon so that's gonna be very exciting I'll see you guys then peace Alrighty gang, it's almost 3 a.m. and we're about to go grab our suhoor. SubhanAllah and Alhamdulillah, Alhamdulillah, Alhamdulillah. We're able to find a good place to take care of this. Oh my lord. The I car just started shaking by like crazy yeah, vibrations. Yeah, you, you can tell, like you feel it. Like, I was like trying to figure out what's going on. Be careful, those are sharp. Yeah. It was crazy. At first I thought it had something to do with the water and maybe it was underneath the tire or maybe hydroplaning or something. All these lights started coming on in the dash, but mm -hmm. yeah, it was a little intense. Alhamdulillah. Crazy. Alhamdulillah. All right, let's go eat. I'm hungry. Good old fashioned IHOP. Let's go inside and chow down, shall we? This one's for my lady. All right. <laughs> you to get your food. pancakes are on the way out, and I'll be right back with yeah. my water. Bone appetite. Bismillah. First take, first try. No BS. <laughs> yes. Beautiful. All righty, ladies and gents. That was a great suhoor. And uh, what's next on the agenda will actually happen in approximately one hour and 30 minutes. You have to pay Fajr first. Dummy. Well, there's that too. to walk across this. We're gonna teleport. Ready? Three, two, one. Just like that. See? No problem. And we have a little surprise for mommy. Assalamualaikum. Assalamualaikum. Anusi. Get me both Mm. Hey, How was your flight? How are you going? Hey, Hale. I'm not Salama. She's not. 
All right, everybody. So, alhamdulillah, everybody is home. We're all getting settled. Alhamdulillah, here's baby Ibrahim. Oh, hey. Hi. Hey, Anissa. Hi. So, the game plan is later today, my parents are going to be coming in, and it's going to be a surprise when they, when my mom sees everybody here. So, we're going to get that on camera, inshallah. I will catch up with you guys then. Stay tuned. All right, everybody. So, the moment we've been waiting for, my parents are almost here, inshallah. They are on their way about maybe two to three minutes. So, everybody's going to go up. And the plan is that my sister-in-law, Lina, is going to be holding their baby, Ibrahim, and uh, see Mama's reaction from that. We do have a second camera for another vantage point right over here. So this is going to be really exciting, inshallah. Mm -hmm. All right, everybody, calm down. Calm down, be cool. Okay. Okay, I'm excited now. No. <laughs> So just a quick change of plans. They're gonna hide in there instead. It's a lot quicker than coming down the stairs instead. did give it a thumbs up don't forget to subscribe make sure you hit that notification bell and i'll see you guys in the next one and a happy eid mubarak peace out